the, the Kate routine is late last night. I got to go out in the yard and kick the ball around for the dog, right? He's got a oh, collection no. of soccer balls and this and that out there. They're frozen solid. <laughs> the poor guy, you know, he's trying to pick up a soccer ball. It's like a big rock. And so. his tongue is sticking to <laughs> it. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Yeah. yeah. So it's very cold out there, well below zero. Now it stays that way almost until noon today. It's kind of a longer, more prolonged cold snap. And I think that we'll see a few extra clouds today with sun filtering through at times. Let's look at what's happening on the island where it's completely dry, only completely clear on the west coast. Minus two in Dufino, a few clouds, minus three in Victoria. Your maximum today is five degrees and it's going to be part cloud and part sun but cool and dry all the way through and in the sea to sky country there's already some clouds drifting down over sections of the sunshine coast and showing up in Worcester minus seven right now I don't think it gets much above minus five today so well below freezing in Worcester at all elevations for the following 24 hours and even for the following couple of days no snow in the forecast but it's cold enough to be making some snow now in the Fraser Valley so far a half a dozen degrees below zero in Abbotsford you can see it's colder than it was yesterday and the wind is flushing out from hope on the order of 20 to 25 5K from the northeast. That supplies the cold air all day long. So even with a lot of sun, as good as it gets is plus two for a short period of time in the valley, right back down to minus four for a frosty Friday morning. Here's your current temperatures around Metro Vancouver, and it's under a mostly clear sky. We've got minus two in West Vancouver, minus four in parts of Surrey, and we'll be aiming for a high today of only plus three, the coldest day of the week, but still a little sun mixed in with some of those clouds. And then it busts wide open for beautiful conditions Friday and Saturday. The mornings are frosty, the afternoons a little milder, up to eight degrees by Saturday. Saturday. Sunday remains dry and then it starts to change next week. I'll be adding extra clouds and eventually a chance of precipitation through the midweek forecast, but it does look like rain and not snow. Good news, isn't it, Riaz? Minus four in the overnight. Breakfast television participating in the sleep out with Covenant House oh, Vancouver. Oh, my goodness. Well, bundle up, my friend. It's going to be chilly. Yeah.